um, when celebrities don't get recognized. With celebrities... Get Which is actually really cool because every time they do get recognized, they're like, oh man, like, I just want my peace. But then when they don't get recognized, a lot of them get offended. So I want to see here. Getting recognized everywhere they go, for some anonymity might be a nice change of pace. And for others, a major blow to the ego. When 6'9 LeBron James walked in with a stack of pizzas from the kitchen at Blaze Pizzeria, people were extremely confused because it wouldn't make sense to actually be him. And well, others just straight up had no idea who he was. What's going on, man? How you doing? Sean I'm, Mendez I'm was- I'm sorry, guys, but he's so tall. Like, you have to recognize him. You just look at him like, oh my God, this is such a big guy. And then you're like, wait a minute having some alone time at a coffee shop when he was approached to take a video. At first, he said no until he was told it was not actually a video of him. You might know, I hold his phone, I'm gonna, uh, I wanna do a video for my mom, you just hold it. No, I'm sorry, bro. No, you it? No, I'm sorry. You, you won't be in it. Oh, just for you. Yeah, 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 I'm a, I'm a little so it's already going. There we go. You're not the first one. Orlando Bloom is a famous English actor that's been seen in some of the most well-known movies like Lord of the Rings. But apparently Billie Eilish had no idea who he was when Katy Perry introduced him, only to find afterwards from her friends who he was. Guys, that guy. it was him? Yeah. Are you kidding me, Billie Eilish? Are you kidding me? How did you not recognize him? That was him? <laughs> Wait, I'm so skinny. No way. I wouldn't know anything about that. Bring him back. I want to meet him again. A humbling moment for Jennifer Lopez happened when she went to visit her childhood home with a TV crew, expecting I, I to be that recognized one. I saw this and one get here. a whole moment out of it. But the man currently living in the house didn't seem too amused. Huh? My name is Jennifer. Jennifer? Yeah, I used to live up, and then my room was upstairs right there. Jennifer Lopez. Who's Jennifer Lopez? <gasps> Me! I used to live here. Okay, maybe this is not recognized in this a different- This is so, like, humbling. And a humbling experience for all of these celebrities. And I hope, I hope it leaves an impact on them. To know, like, not everybody knows who you are. And not everybody will, like, have the same exciting, surprise, shocked, uh, happy face knowing or see hearing your name, you know? When you like, this is the part where they tell you you're just another human being, and like, it's so humbling. Way. But film director Sam Mendes got overshadowed by Leonardo DiCaprio when Titanic actress Kate Winslet was giving her best actress speech in 2009. Two incredible men who are such special people in my world. And Leo, I'm so happy I can stand here and tell you how much I love you and how much I've loved you for 13 years. <laughs> I love you with all my heart. I really do. And my husband, Sam, thank you for directing this film, babe. When the whole Cleveland Cavaliers had to resort to the <sighs> NYC subway to get to the arena, Bro, you can't do that. Oh, that must feel so shitty. Oh, no. <laughs> Why would she do that? First, put your husband first, sweetie. Put your husband first and then mention Leo and whoever. Hey, Leo, I love you with all my heart for 13 years. Oh, yeah, my husband. Yeah, I, th I love you too, bro. Thanks for directing this movie and putting me into it. And giving me an Oscar because of that. Thanks for believing in me. On time, a commuter wasn't very happy. What's the question? What's the question? I don't know this dude right here. He tripping. He <laughs> a biker at a light turned to check the vehicle next to him to see Shia LaBeouf just dead staring at him. How you doing? Good. How you? Oh, Shia always asks good. for trouble in these situations. Despite being in one of the biggest TV shows in history, Amelia Clark somehow tends to blend in with people much more than her co-stars, and even told Conan that she's often the one asked to take the pictures. I'll be walking with Kit Harrington, plays John Snow, or Gwen, A bit or of my like personality, that, and they will be, yeah. people will be like, oh, can you take this picture for us? Yeah, yeah. I'm like, sure, definitely I can, sure I can. I'll go into the, like, I'll be like, Kit, just be one minute, I'm just gonna go into the loo, and then Maybe I'll Maybe if she wears the white like, hair. Yeah. girl that he's with? Like, hey, it's me. Comedian Jerry Seinfeld is known for being a germaphobe and is not a fan of physical contact with others. So in f We all know this one, right? This one is... Yeah, we all know the Kesha one. Uh, or Kesha or whatever her name is. But can you believe that he is the biggest celebrity? He earns the most... 
even more than The Rock? This guy! Seinfeld! He's number one! Famous singer Kesha ran Crazy. up to him asking for a hug. She was turned down, and he didn't know who she was either. Kesha, I love you so much. Oh, thanks. Can I give you a hug? No, thanks. Please? No, thanks. A little one. Yeah, no thanks. Oh. <laughs> that was a nice moment. I don't know who that was. <laughs> yeah, it was Kesha. Okay. Well, I wish you the best. Adam Sandler took uh, his daughter to the local IHOP on a busy best. Sunday morning, and the waitress didn't recognize him. So when she told him there was a 40-minute wait, he left. And well, people gave him props for not pulling the celebrity card. And later, IHOP yeah. organized a charity all-you-can-drink milkshakes event after finding out what happened. That's Elle nice. Fanning might have shown some sociopathic tendencies on The Conan Show when she revealed that she likes to make up lives when getting in an Uber. I don't know who I am, and I just find that fascinating. So I go in, I kind of make up careers or like stories to tell the uber driver so i totally just That's like nice. them. Yeah. yeah you're a sociopath i think yeah. it's a word. <laughs> when it comes to celebrity sightseeing a lift is the last place you'd think of seeing one that's why a Demi Lovato fan did not recognize her despite already having met her in the past. And her reaction when she found out is hilarious. I actually met Demi Lovato too one time. Was she nice? Yeah, she was super, super, super nice. Oh, well, it's good to see you again. Yeah, you have a... Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! But Demi Lovato have. wasn't the only one not recognized when driving for Lyft, with Shaq being able to catch some people off guard with his costumes. Go free throws, spread your fingers out. And then follow through, watch your nails, I want you to do your nails off. So you just learn from the greatest free throw culture of all time. <laughs> when Selena Gomez was being driven to the hotel from the airport, the driver had no idea who she was or why so many people were surrounding her at the airport. And well, during the drive, they had a good conversation and Selena Gomez made a sweet video for the man's daughter. I'm speaking to this amazing man right now and I just wanted to tell you I love you and I hope everything's going well. Okay. What do I say? Yeah, I, I. You don't know my name. No. Say I, it. Say, say, Selena. Yes. Selena Gomez. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm sorry. No, it's epic. I didn't, I didn't want you to know no, my name. No, I named Gomez, man. I, I, I named in my mind Gomez. At Adele's birthday party, no. she set up a karaoke booth for her guests to show off their singing skills. And Ashton Kutcher happened to be amazed by one of the guests' voice. He does this like ABBA song that's like so, I, I'm like, oh my God, it's like banana. Mila and I go up to him and we're like, you're a ringer. You're definitely, you're like a karaoke ringer. You're really good, like, uh, like really good. And he's like, thanks man, I, thank you. I really appreciate that. So we go to our friend and we go, God, that guy was really good, huh? And they're like, it's Harry Styles. A Brazilian tourist in Bulgaria was curious and took a picture with a man who everyone wanted to take pictures with and had many cameras following him. Little did she know it was the president of Bulgaria. What are you? Why are you important? You are important. I'm not so important. Nah, no, like, people are taking pictures and uh, yeah. uh, you're important. Why? I'm the president. <laughs> For the Jimmy Kimmel show, Jennifer Lawrence Why was set to surprise fans on Hollywood Boulevard, but instead she found the biggest Jennifer Aniston fan. Five Jennifer Lawrence movies. Five Jennifer Lawrence movies. I know. Uh, who is no. that bitch? He asked me about Aniston. I could tell you. Right. Jennifer, Jennifer Aniston is know. way better than Jennifer yeah, Lawrence. No Do idea. you agree? Fine. Yeah. Much yes, better. Yes, I love her. Prettier, funnier. Yes. Yeah. Yes, better her. movies. Yes. Yes. I yeah. love her. Yeah. <laughs> Overall. Yeah. Great. Um, I'm I Jennifer love Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence. <laughs> okay, not sure why Floyd Jennifer Mayweather was in a barber shop to begin with, but a rude woman was annoyed by the amount of attention he was receiving and started going after him. I don't know you. I don't know you. I don't know you. So what's the big deal? You got to tell them. Oh, no, no, I know about. I don't like celebrities who are so like you have to know me, and if you don't know me, like. They get so mad and they make a scene about it. Like, she doesn't know you. Like, what's the problem? The brain gets humble. Wait, wait, what is it? Hey. Lewis Hamilton is perhaps the most famous Pull driver in Formula yeah. One, but for some reason got mad after security didn't recognize him with the helmet on. Wets his past to get of course he's the driver, this. you see what Turks he's wearing! Duh. Lamb of God's lead singer was pleasantly surprised when security for his own event didn't recognize him. Are you fucking kidding me, man? It's the event, it's the group, it's like, just do a research, like, just write the, like, what? I, I'm the singer, I'm singer, so. 
Migos rapper Offset was stopped by That's the police nice. a few That's years so ago modest. due to having a window tent too dark for the legal limit. He did try to pull the famous card, but sadly for him, the police did not recognize him. And he even FaceTimed his lawyer in Cardi B during the whole ordeal. I'm, sir, I'm famous too, so okay, I, I know my rights. You said you're famous, who are you? I'm Offset Migos. Who's that? <laughs> I don't even know who that is. Okay. The Matrix is one of the most successful movies of all time, generating over half a billion in the box office, and it's still quoted in pop culture till this day. Despite yep. this, Keanu Reeves managed to successfully go incognito in public while riding on the subway, and he because even gave up his seat. I think like because the, the movie is like in the 90s and this maybe happened in 2000, so a lot of people forgot about it, and he was out of the scene for a way longer time. Like now, I feel like if now he did something like that, everybody would recognize him, right? With his longer hair, John. He to an older woman. That's so nice, man. With Taylor Swift swinging her first music publishing deal at the age of 14, she's been in the spotlight ever since she was a kid. So when she visited South Korea and nobody recognized her back in 2011, she said it was a nice change of pace. Reese Witherspoon's so cool. reputation took a big blow after official police dash cam footage was released of her husband being arrested over suspected driving under the influence, and she went to confront the police. The actress ended up being arrested for obstruction of justice that night. Yes, ma'am. Are you kidding me? You know my name, sir? Don't hate enough. You don't need to know my name? Not quite yet. I'll get oh, that really? information. Well, if you don't know my name, that doesn't mean... Find out who I am. In perhaps oh, one of the funniest <laughs> unrecognized celebrity moments, Enrique Iglesias worked a shift at Astro Burger in West Hollywood and kind of started messing with some of the... How you don't recognize Enrique Iglesias? Like, I, he has such a unique face. How can you not recognize him? Even if you don't recognize him, I would like, if I see a man like that working in a place like this, I would literally just say, bro, you're a model. What are you doing? Get a better job, man. Like, look at yourself. He's so fine. Oh my the god. <laughs> Arizona? Why is her friend laughing? <laughs> she went to an all girls school. I don't know what she's talking about. But things quickly went downhill when fellow celebrity Amy Smart went into the store. And even though Enrique Iglesias did recognize her, she didn't and didn't appreciate his sense of humor. You are famous. That's cool. Would you ever go out with a guy that flips burgers? Yeah, but I have boyfriends so. though. Does he flip burgers? No. How long have you been dating? Off and on, 10 years. 10 years? Off and on? Don't get mad. I'll give you a pro Trust me, you'll be thanking me years from now. No, he's not. You should give him what he wants. It doesn't matter. I don't know. Just relax. I'm not. You're harassing everybody in here. What do you mean I'm harassing? Just, he needs a protein burger. When Lil Uzi Vert was going oh to make a surprise God, appearance hell? at Gunna's concert, security did not recognize him and turned into a scuffle. Karen. Surprisingly, when Kendall and Kylie Jenner went through the drive through at In-N-Out, either they weren't recognized or the employees decided to not make a fuss about it. Bread and grilled onions, please. And wow, same thing for me. Okay, so should we just sit in the thing and eat? Former NFL star Adrian Peterson was asked by a reporter so? his opinion about road rage without knowing who he was and the reaction of the reporter when he finds out is priceless. Okay. Adrian Peterson. Hi. Wait a minute, you're not... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ed O'Neill's daughter jaw dropped when he sent her a picture him. asking who the woman in the picture is, is because he knew that she was famous but couldn't figure out who it was. I, I desperately need to know a name so that when I, I couldn't even say the name, you know, yeah. wonderful to meet you. And so I don't know if you have the picture. <laughs> Taylor, that's fun. At least a lot of them, okay, there were there were situations where they got arrogant and full of themselves. But uh, the majority of these were just, like, charming. I think that was a fun video. Oh, okay.